Curtis Trades here, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Zupa Solar Trickle Charger. And what this is, is this is a trickle charger which is meant to maintain a battery, a 12 volt battery specifically, over a long duration of not being used. So for example, if you were storing a collector's car, storing a boat for the winter, um, storing an RV for a really long time, you might want to put a solar battery charger like this one on there. And what it does is it provides a a low charge for it over a long duration of time. And this one uses a solar panel to charge it. So you don't have to use any electricity to do it. You don't have to have an electrical hookup. If you have it in a storage area where you can't get electricity, this is a really awesome uh, thing to have for it. If you are looking to purchase this, check out the link in the description. And if you have any questions or comments, let me know down below. And it's super simple to use. It's set up to use almost any 12 volt battery. Double check in the user manual to make sure it works with the 12 volt battery that you have. I believe this one works with uh, gel batteries, lithium ion, and most standard car and auto and RV batteries. Um, but double check to make sure this one works with it. Basically what it does is it uses the solar panel here to collect um, energy from the sun and it will slowly trickle charge your battery to maintain it over a long duration so it doesn't go flat. And what that will really do is it will really save you a lot of money and maintenance costs over the life of the battery. And typically if you leave a battery unplugged and not in use for a really long time, um, they tend to wear out a lot quicker than they would otherwise. So what these will do is it will help with the longevity of your battery so you won't have to buy a new battery as often. And they're really nice because it uses a solar panel so you don't have to be hooked up to electricity. Now this one here, um, it has a little charging light on the back here. If it shows a blue light, it means it is getting energy from the sun currently. If there's no blue light, it is not getting any sun from or energy from the sun. The red light means that it's charging and the green light means that it's fully charged or it's maintaining the charge. These aren't for recharging a completely dead battery. So these can help maintain an older battery too that's slowly losing its charge. So if you have a battery that's four, five, six years old and you wanna get a couple more years out of it, one of these is a really good way to do that. And the nice thing is it comes with suction cups so you can put it on the inside of your windshield. I really like that option the best because I don't want it out in the elements. It could blow away in the wind if you don't have it securely attached or get damaged. So I think the best mounting option is obviously on the inside of a window. It does come with carabiner mounts and suction cup mounts. And then it's got a couple different options for um, how you hook it up to your battery. So you can unplug it here. This is a cigarette lighter or a 12 volt outlet so you can plug it in on the inside of your vehicle. It also does come with um, clamps to hook it directly to the battery and you can have your hood popped and have the solar panel on the outside. And then it does also come with um, battery terminal posts so you can hook it directly to the battery instead of using the clamps to clamp it to the battery. So it does have a lot of really good options for mounting and it's overall works really good. And then they do make these in a lot of different wattages too. This is the 30 watt model. They do have some of the smaller solar panels for 20 watts, I believe 10 watts and five watts are some of the different models that they have. 